Hey everyone, welcome back to Star Wars Thrifting. I'm going to do something a little different today. I'm actually going to be sharing a Star Wars thrift haul, but not mine. It's actually going to be my mom's. My mom is super sweet and supportive of my love for Star Wars. She always has been my entire life. Um, to getting me Star Wars socks, to buying midnight tickets for Revenge of the Sith for me and my friends to go to in high school. Um, so she's always been so supportive. So I was really excited that when I, you know, when I saw her last weekend, she said, hey, before you go, I have something for you. She brought out a bag of Star Wars thrift goods that she had collected um, at Goodwills and garage sales and such. So let's go through them and see how she did. Okay, first up, um, looks like some Star Wars playing cards. Um, you can never have enough playing cards, um, especially when I like to beat everyone at Go Fish. But these are pretty cool. These are, ooh, there are a lot in here. So they're just like playing cards. So you have some that are Darth Vader, um, some that are Luke. So the back says Luke. And then like in the, in these cards, you have like stills from the movies, which it's so again you can never have too many playing cards you never know next up uh, this is so i love this so much this is a stormtrooper lego keychain that if i can get it to focus, i'm probably not guys i'm not really good at focusing uh 2006 lego stormtrooper keychain um to put on my set of keys i love it good job mom Next up, um, <laughs> this is a Darth Vader bubble thing. Um, it's a Darth Vader lightsaber bubble. <laughs> this is fun. <gasps> is it going to work? Ooh, not on the keyboard. <gasps> Whoa. At first I was excited. I was like, ooh, lollipop. But it's bubbles. Bubbles are just as fun. This is Ray's speeder. <gasps> Look at that. Oh my goodness. I can totally put this on my bookshelf or something. Um, <gasps> love it. Look at it. Has her thrift haul on the side. Just like me. So cool. Next up is from that Disney Infinity line. Um, and it's a Boba Fett. Look at that. So I love the style of these little figures. I think they're so, I mean, they're just, just the way they look, they look so unique. Um, I love the detail. I find these a lot at the flea market. Like the, like they're just like loose and I'm telling you, I pick them up. So I'm trying to collect all every Star Wars item of these cause I want the whole set. Next up. <laughs> I don't collect Hot Wheels, but I'm glad I'm starting now because look at what I'm starting off with. Good job, Mom. How did you know? A baby Grogu. Oh my goodness. And you can display. If you take him out of the box, he can stand. <gasps> oh my goodness. But the question is, do I take him out? Do I leave him in here? I don't know. I feel like I'd lose him. See, I almost dropped him. <laughs> I feel like I'd lose them. Uh, you might just stay in the box. Look how cute. Oh my goodness, mom. That's a, that's a high five on my part. Okay, next is, um, this says do or do not. There is no try. It's a cute little inspirational quote. Such a mom gift. Like mom is going to give you something like some inspirational sayings to put in your house. So this is kind of on brand of mom. Thanks mom. I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with it, but it's these cute, tiny little miniature figures. They're so small. Little tiny miniature figures. They're so small. Look how cute Chewbacca is and look at C-3PO. So this is Chewbacca and the disassembled did I say that right? Disassembled C-3PO from Empire Strikes Back. So, and does he put him on his back? Oh my goodness. Love that scene in um, Empire Strikes Back when he's like just broken apart and Chewie's trying to fix him. And then when he has like, oh, don't have time, just 
you know, strap some in his like makeshift backpack. I love that. I think to me, that's just pure comedy. I think Empire Strikes Back is just a funny movie. Cool. I think my mom did a great job. Thank you, mom. This is a great thrift haul. You guys, let my mom know what you guys think of her thrifting haul. Good job, mom. You're a Star Wars thrifter. Thanks, mom. Okay, so I did want to share something that I found. Um, this is just so good not to share. This is um, a Darth Vader spinning. Once you put batteries, I was not prepared. I should have put batteries. It's like a light that flashes and also spins Darth Vader's head. This is from 1992, okay? And this is this was like a souvenir that was sold at the George Lucas Super Live Adventure. And for those who don't know, because I just found out recently and it's so wonderful that I just living in this world where now I know this existed. Um, it was an event in Japan in 1992 where they think of like to see on ice, like a event um, <laughs> that celebrated George Lucas and all his movies. It was called the George Lucas Super Live Adventure and it showcased all of his movies, Willow, American Graffiti, Star Wars, Indiana Jones. And it's just like, so, I mean, to way to like celebrate George Lucas was this amazing live show in Japan. Like, and this is, I'm assuming like was sold. You can just like buy one of these, like at a souvenir stand. I mean, this is amazing. Um, this is probably my favorite thing in my collection so far right now. It's always changing, but this is definitely like a really, really good one, <laughs> right? I just love that it's so wild and random and like there's a super live adventure. Like what? I love it. Thank you guys so much for checking out my video. If you're new to the channel, welcome. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys haven't already, please like and subscribe for more Star Wars thrifting coming your way. Thank you guys so much. Bye.